In this video, we're gonna be adding Google AdSense to our WordPress website. I'm not gonna be using a plugin or anything like that. We're just gonna be taking some AdSense code and we're gonna be dropping it onto our WordPress site. It's all gonna work just fine. <laughs> Let's get started. Hello, it's Alex here from WP Eagle. I hope you're all well. Thanks for watching. So in this video, we're gonna be adding Google AdSense to our WordPress website. If you don't know what Google AdSense is, but I'm sure you do, that's why you're watching this video. But if you don't, Google AdSense allows you to put ads on your site, basically, that are served by Google. They're kind of the other side of Google AdWords, if that makes any sense. And you're then able to earn a bit of money from these ads. You know, people click on them or look at them, that kind of thing you learn a very, very small amount of money. Um, in order to get rich off Google AdSense, you're gonna need a lot of traffic. Um, but hey, if you want a little bit of extra beer money or something for the week, then AdSense might be perfect. So in this video, we're not gonna be using any plugins or anything like that. We're just gonna go over to AdSense. We're gonna create the ad unit. We're then gonna take the code that Google give us and put it onto the website with a bit of copying and pasting. So pretty straightforward. This tutorial um, should work with pretty much any WordPress site that you happen to be running. So uh, anyway, that's enough chat from me, enough looking at my face. Let's get on a computer and get this AdSense set up. So the site I'm gonna be adding AdSense to today is Boot Boutique, the classic. Uh, it's one that I created in a previous tutorial a little while back. It's an Amazon affiliate site powered by WooZone and WooCommerce. Um, but what I'm gonna show you today will work on any WordPress site doesn't have to be an affiliate site, could be a blog, could be a shop, could be anything. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna be adding it to a widget down the sidebar. So if I go into uh, the blog on this site, um, ignore that skewed image, I don't know what's going on there. Um, but down this uh, right hand side, we've got the sidebar and that's where I'm gonna add an ad. Add an ad, there we go. <laughs> so uh, let's do that now, it's pretty straightforward. Um, in this tab here, I've got my AdSense, here it is. I'm already logged in on my homepage, you can see, wow, I'm making some serious coin, sort of, not really. Uh, but um, hey, AdSense is not gonna make you really rich unless you've got a lot of traffic, but hey, it's a nice bit of extra money, isn't it? So I'm gonna go into my ads, and then I'm gonna go to create new ad unit. And the one we want is a text and display ads. You've got a few options there. You've got in article ads as well that you can put in for you know, like in the middle of your content if you want. But uh, today we're just gonna go for the text and display ads. So select. Now you can have the automatic size, which works pretty well, or you can uh, choose your own size. Something like 300 by 250 is probably fine. Um, maybe a little smaller, 250 by 250 is probably better. Depends on the size of your theme in terms of how much sidebar you've got on your theme. But if we go for a responsive, it should it should change its shape and size to fit the space, which is good, especially if you've got mobile uh, traffic, that kind of stuff. So I'm just gonna call this boot uh, boutique oh, blog ad. We could decide whether we want text or display ads. So display ads are you know, images, text is just text. So, well, we'll leave it at that for now, see what we get. And then you can decide what style you want, whether you want it colorful, dark blue, neon, splash of color, mm, I don't know, whatever. Or you can obviously match it so that it fits um, the style of your site if you want. I mean, just add the colors here. I think the high contrast white or the high contrast black is probably fine, let's go for that. Here you got some custom channels, don't need that. And if no ads available, collapse the ad unit, otherwise show blank space. So that's fine. So now we're gonna click save and get code. It says it's done it. Then what we need to do is copy this. So I'm just gonna click on it and then click, oh sorry, then I'm gonna press Command C on my Mac, could be Control C on your PC to copy it to, to copy it <laughs> to copy it to my clipboard. Also right click and select copy if that's easier. Um, so there we go and close that. So let's go back to the WordPress site. I'm already logged in. I'm then going to go to uh, widgets up here. 
can also get to it via appearance and widgets. Got my blog sidebar here and I need a text widget. So let's find a text widget. There it is. Let's add it to the blog and widget. I'm just going to paste that code in. I'm going to make sure I select the text editor. Okay, that's an interesting point. It said, I've only just updated this site to the latest version of WordPress. It says there's a new custom HTML widget, which is actually probably better because that's what we're pasting in. So make sure you're running the latest version of WordPress and use the custom HTML widget. If you're not, then you can just use the text widget. It should work as well. Make sure you switch it from, um, off the visual editor to the text editor. Anyway, let's paste that in and give it a title of sponsored. Sponsored, if I can spell it. Is that it? Yeah, sponsored. Sponsored, that's fine. And save. So that should be done. Let's go and have a look at the site. Blog. There's me add. Ta da. Let's see, it's gone for a long one. I guess the long one's fine. I mean, you might just want to restrict it to a square. It's really up to you. But obviously, you can change that in here. I don't know if I can change it on the fly. Let's have a look. Um, maybe click Edit Add Type. No. Uh, you can't can't change it once you've done it. You have to create another one. Fair enough. That's fine. So yeah, if I wanted to do a square, let's do a square one now, just for fun, eh? Why not? What fun it is adding um, AdSense Boot boutique square. Come on, spelling. We can do this squared. So I think probably around two fifty is about right, and I just want to kind of square, square. Perfect. Two fifty by two fifty. And, and whatever, 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 blah, 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 get the code. Copy to my clipboard, back in here, into the widgets. Let's add another bit of custom HTML into the blog. You can just drag as well, like that. A square ad. What a great title for a square ad. Let's go back and take it, did that save? Sometimes you click on these buttons and it doesn't do it. Yeah, it did. Let's go and have a look. Into the blog. Okay, my square ad isn't showing. Could be because they haven't found any square ads for me that's suitable. Possibly. Or it could be that there's a delay. Although that one wasn't delayed. What I'm going to do is I'm going to wait uh, just a few moments, maybe an hour or so, and see if the ad appears. That can be a problem, and I stress to you that if you do this and nothing um, appears, then just wait a little while. That should be all you need to do. So I'm going to do a quick edit now, and um, yeah, some time will have passed when I speak again. Okay, so after about 20 minutes, the ad is now showing. Yippee! So that's the square ad, that's the 250 by 251, which looks quite nice. I think it looks better maybe than the the long one, but it's obviously up to you what size you want to use. So that's it. So that's the end of this video. I hope you've now got AdSense installed and you've got some ads showing, all being well. Uh, if you haven't, for whatever reason, or you're stuck or something didn't work, then do let me know in the comments below. I do love to hear from you guys. And I do try and reply to as many comments as I possibly can. If you're not already subscribed, then do join us. There's nearly 18,000 of you. In fact, by the time you watch this video, there may well be 18,000 of you, which is incredible. I can't believe it. So uh, yeah, if you're not one of those 18,000, then please come and join us. It's fun, kind of, with WP Eagle. Yeah, click on that bird thing up there, that eagle. It'd <laughs> be good to see you. And if you fancy watching something else with me in it, there's a video there. It's chosen specially for you. Until next time, bye for now.